Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Last Ketchum. So exciting, exciting stuff today. I got something in the mail that I want to show off and also want to show off some of our pickups recently because I think they're great. So I want to start honestly with the package first. It was actually during a giveaway on Let's Spot Up If I Can Talk. Guys, oh my gosh, they deserve full being able to talk clearly moment. Let's start a pop collection. Love them. Um, Jeremy and Michelle, they are super amazing. They're adorable to watch. I love their backgrounds. I love their cute little prop changes. They had a cute little turkey. I think the day, the day that I had won this. Anyway, I'm excited to get it out and just kind of, I don't know, hopefully get some of their stickers and things like that. So let's get in there. Dun, dun, dun. And guys, seriously, thank you so much. I'm so excited to have something from y'all. I'm excited I have won something. It's just always fun. Oh, I better move the box. I'm gonna like throw y'all. so bad about that. Anyway, uh, how about we just close this before I stab myself? That wouldn't be unlike me. Oh my gosh, there's a note. They are so adorable, guys. Last, congrats on winning our giveaway on the live stream for R2-D2's brother. <laughs> Thank you for all of your support. Thank you, Jeremy and Mitchie at Let's Start a Pop Collection. I love it, guys. That's adorable. God, y'all are cute. Okay. Oh, my gosh. There's a little goodie bag. I have one, like, bonuses. Let's see. My kids are probably going to steal, like, half of this. Let's get real. Grinch pencil. Super cute. That reminds me, I have a pop I'll have to show off to y'all at some point. Always amazing. Dip out some hot chocolate. Oh my god, y'all. Y'all are so flipping cute. There we go. Nice. Oh my god, is this like slime? Like, oh my god, that's gonna be everywhere. It's beautiful. Dig it it's going right now you can't see it but trust me and it's still going that's actually really exciting it has not stopped it's spinning as we speak I would move y'all but I'd probably like to spend 12 years fixing the camera it's done that was so exciting it's kind of cute it's like themed as far as like I got a lot of pink in there and I dig it matches my chomp very cute Mitchy. thank you I know that was you so I appreciate all of that definitely definitely going to be eating this like probably the second I get off of here box. All right guys, let me show y'all what I got. Which I know I already read that but here we go. It is the Artist Series C3PO. Very cool pop. Really I love all the Artist Series pops. I love all the little extra things that they do to them. I just think they're really creative and beautiful so I think it's exciting to get those I don't really think the hard sacks are always necessary with these but at the same time I like I guess maybe because they cost a little more but it's nice having hard stacks and I mean at least you know your pop should be coming in good condition because let's face it most of us are always worried about things shipping correctly and these usually get where they're going and fine even to the store so I am not, and feel free to judge me fully, I am not a huge Star Wars fan. I do appreciate it. I watched a lot of the older movies like when I was younger. So I'm not like not into Star Wars, but it's not my biggest like fandom, I guess you could say, line. But I wanted and love getting pops that I can actually end up giving to other people that I know that it is a bigger part of their collection and a bigger want. Especially with the holidays coming up, I definitely have some gifts that are going out. And honestly, this was a way for me to spread the love. So y'all sharing with me just helps me love on someone else. And I am so excited. And I love that as collectors, the idea of just kind of passing that forward. You know, I know a lot of them are like, keep one, move it on. But for me, sometimes with these giveaways, it's because they have purpose. And I get to love on somebody through that too. Yeah. So it's just a way of continuing to be able to add to other people's collections and enjoy collecting together. So I am so excited to be able to do that. And what a cool one to be able to do that with. 
Like, I don't even know how to say it other than just thank you. And I'm excited and I do love this. And I'm excited to have things from y'all that I get to share as well, like on an ongoing kind of way. And by the way, I suck. I still don't have a board to put all my stuff up on. Hopefully I get that soon because I do want to kind of show off, even for me, just to have a place that's kind of put together for all the things people have been able to send. So I will get that. But anyway, one last huge thank you. Now, beyond this, the other things that I have. And guys, by the way, I will have down below the link to Let's Start a Pop Collections YouTube channel. Um, I love them. They are amazing. So please check them out. If you're not already familiar, you probably are. They're a lot cooler than me. But anyway, I'll have that down below. You know, give a like, give a comment, subscribe if you like it. You know, but anyway, they're great. Okay, so recent pickups. First one, we were in Target and it looks like all the pops have been like hard picked over like they have not gotten anything in kind of a thing not a whole lot there something that we hadn't already seen a thousand times but as we're going there was like this weird little added end cap thing like it wasn't even quite on the end it was like hanging kind of weird sideways anyways this odd little end cap moment but it had several pops and it included the retro toys, which I was very excited about because they had one that we actually wanted. So I was able to get one and my beautiful assistant slash spouse was able to add one to his collection as well. So let me show you what that is. It's a Mr. Potato Head mix up only at Target retro toys. Anyway, I think he's fun. I actually like this better than the normal one. With the normal one, I feel like I could just like pull out one of our normal, I don't know, toys. I don't know. I just think this one's more exciting. It's different. I think it's cool. And I always appreciate retro moments, anything that's like nostalgic. And I think it's nostalgic for really two reasons. One, because I don't know about y'all, but I definitely had one of these toys as a kid. Um, I think my kids have had this toy, but it also makes me think of Toy Story. So all around just a fun toy, fun pop. So very excited to randomly find this and that awkward little whatever it was at Target. So got that. Now, the next one is one that we actually got today. Hot Topic, if you haven't been, they go to doing all their like Black Friday stuff. They've got like buy two pops, get one free. Uh, my angel of a spouse that loves me for whatever reason decided to give me the free one. So he got what he wanted and he got this one for me. And this is one that I honestly just think is really cool looking. I love anime, but I am not like a big Naruto person. Again, judge me harshly if you want. Um, it's not that anything's wrong with it. It's just not one I've really dived into. And plus, there's so many out there. I can't love all of them. I mean, I probably could, but I just, uh, you know, whatever. Only so much time and energy. But this is a cool looking pop. And if you have watched me for a while, you know I have a thing for pops that I think are artistic or beautiful or unique in some way or nostalgic or memories or whatever. I'm so weird with my picks. I just think this one's amazing looking. It's got metallic touches, if that tells you what it is already, maybe. But I think it's really cool. So, my gift slash cool new pop is Gara. It's the metallic guys. Those blue eyes. Oh my gosh. They're beautiful. I think I honestly am a fan of like any blue eye pop. I don't know why. I think the blue is just really pretty. But guys, the sand metallic look like... I don't know. I just, I think it's gorgeous. So this is one of those that again, it's not like it's a favorite show or anything. This is just me appreciating something because I, I honestly, I just think it's creative. I think it's interesting. I think it's beautiful. So that is stuff that I'm always excited to have in my collection. And I mean, it was free, which is cool. So they had a lot, like this is one that honestly, I'm surprised they didn't have it as like a separate display, like they do with a lot of the cool new ones or exclusives, but this one was just out. They just had it kind of shoved in all the normal stacks and they had a whole lot of them, um, which again, I'm kind of surprised. I actually think this is a really cool pop. So I don't know, 
know. We'll see. But if y'all love Naruto or you're kind of like me, just love interesting or cool characters, anime characters, artistic looking characters, I definitely think this is a cool one for any collection. So y'all can let me know what you think. You can let me know what you think about all of these because they're all so cool. I feel like it was mainly kind of nostalgic and artistic looking pops today, which was not intentional. It just happened that way. And all my fun little things that I will get to snack on much, fight my children for, you know. So thank you again, Jeremy and Mitchie. I appreciate it. And happy late birthday, Mitchie. I'm sorry I didn't make it to the live, but I bet it was a lot of fun. But anyway, thank you everybody for coming to hang out. I hope you enjoyed what I had today. And let me know what you've picked up recently. I would love to hear it. Bye, guys.